Hey everyone! Uh, so first, I apologize for the delay in getting the uh, videos out. We had to take a temporary pause from design to deal with some lawyery things with uh, TSP. And as you can see, now that I'm back into it, I've uh, gone a little crazy. Um, so the the feature that we're trying to fix now is that uh, I designed the arm, the ball socket joint for the arm, to have this little neck so that um, make sure I get that in the frame, to be able to go into the screw cap nicely where, you know, you just rotate it into place. And now it snaps in, and when you put the screw cap on, you know, it has nowhere to go. Well, one of the suggestions that I got was, instead of doing this and having, having you know, the arm rotate in, um, what if you just have cutouts uh, and as you can see, I had to kind of extend it more until the cutouts are almost all the way to the screw threads, um, so that you can just push the ball through, and then you don't need to have that neck as a weak point. Unfortunately, um, ASA, being as resilient as it is to, you know, thermal and UV, um, it is pretty rigid, so I ended up having to make a design where I made one of the cuts go all the way through, and lo and behold, it works. But uh, the problem is that cut that goes all the way through um, has led to, put that right there. Um, so you can see, okay, here's the cut, it's not too bad. As I start to tighten this screw cap, you can see it starts to separate and Unfortunately, we're now back at the same issue where this doesn't get locked down completely. I mean, it's still hard to move, but it's not locked down completely. Although I do like that um, with the way that I made these chamfers, there's way more range of movement on this. But again, uh, that, that separation when you tighten down on the threads is, I think, problematic. Um, so that's the next thing that I need to focus on and fix. So that's where we're at. If uh, anybody has any suggestions or ideas, we are always happy uh, to hear them out and to test them and show you the results. So thanks for watching.